So now here are some tips and best practices we encourage here at FMT to help you improve conversion with edu an educational event. So whether you're already working with FMT or another marketing firm or you're doing it yourself, here are some tips to help you increase the conversion. So even before the class starts, at the top of that funnel, conversion starts. Conversion starts at the top of the funnel. As soon as someone registers for, for your class, you have a big opportunity to introduce yourself, make that personal connection with registrants and ask them, what are the top two or three things that they really want to get out of the class? This gives you immediate insight into why they signed up. Now, the second tip here, now that you know about their top concerns and goals for attending the class, talk about these topics throughout the course. Weave it into your presentation. Uh, weave, in the, weave in the reasons for them signing up. Emphasize these topics, tell the stories to really bring the content to life and also engage attendees throughout the course. And this leads us to the third tip. Don't wait until the end of the class to encourage attendees to schedule that one-on-one -on -one session. In fact, at the beginning of the course, share with attendees that there's an additional session uh, to the overall course. So this additional session, that one-on-one -on -one meeting, is where they can really apply what they've learned to their personal situation. So emphasize that this is their opportunity to keep the momentum going so that all their time, all their energy and focus on this course, attending the course on improving their financial life, doesn't all go to waste, that they actually can take action to build a better financial future for themselves. And this leads us to the fourth tip. Immediately after the course, within 24 hours, follow up with the attendees. Get their take on how it went. Um, schedule the one-on-one -on -one session if they haven't already scheduled it. And if they want to wait, add the attendee to your CRM and nurture lists. Stay in touch with e-newsletters. Uh, let them know about upcoming courses. Follow up on important milestones. Wish them a happy birthday. Just to check in, right? Interestingly enough, years later, um, some attendees who didn't book a one-on-one -on -one session immediately after the course will come back and tell you that they're ready for the appointment to become your client. Client, And honestly, you'd be surprised how often this happens. We hear it all the time with the advisors that we work with. And we actually had a, one advisor just tell us that an advisor or that an attendee from a course that they did 10 years ago came back and now is a client. This, again, this happens all the time. Thank you.